So I've gotten enough comments asking how to remove the PTFE tubes out of the top of the A1 series and out of the AMS light. And so we're going to take a look at how to do that. First off, you don't want to have your hot end all the way over here extended because when you go to press down, you have a tendency to tip the entire machine. So we're going to start by just pushing that all the way in. And ideally, you're going to have it down touching the build plate. So now you have a solid connection when you push down. Now you can either use a pair of tweezers or this 3D printed tool here. I'll put a link to both of those in the description. And what you're going to do is you're going to try and push down on the black ring while pulling up on the tube. You do these two actions at the same time. Push down, pull up, and it should come right out. To reinstall them, you're just doing the opposite. You're just pushing them in and they should be secure pretty easily. Now for the AMS light, same thing. You're pressing down on the black portion. So I'm supporting the back of it with my two fingers here, I'm pushing down with my thumb, and then I'm pulling out with the, uh, the other hand. So I clearly still have filament loaded, so I can't actually pull it off, but I'm gonna just click it back in. That's nice and secure. Same thing down here, push down, pull up. I hope that was helpful. Um, I know some people were asking for help in the comments there, so um, there's how to remove the PTFE tubes from the AMS system and from the A1 series, and I'll see you in the next one.